So what'd you eat today? You know, I had to work today, so... Mm, you know, I like to go to Quiznos sometimes because it's right outside my office. It's convenient, it's tasty, it's delicious, healthy, with the ball. And it does, you know, I like healthy. So you know, I like the two dollar flat bread sammies. So I get the sammy and the warm delicious pita bread and the roast beef, some some onions and some some uh some salt and pepper, <laughs> you know, roasted and not roasted, I mean grilled, you, you know how they you know what Quiznos does. But you know, I always get so upset when I go to Quiznos because they're so rude. They are so rude. They just tweet They tweet me like I am like I am not not an individual to tweet me like a like a pet And you know sometimes I get upset. But besides besides that Stop You know, I like to eat at lunch at Quiznos because then I feel like I'm saving some walking time so I get back to work earlier. And plus, right after my last break, I just head on over to Coldstone Creamery. It's like a double whammy. <laughs> it's like, it's a double whammy because they're both right next to each other. You know, in Silverdale. They got the Quiznos and they got the Coldstone Creamery. And you know, after a long day of work, the Coldstone Creamery is the perfect ending to a hot summer's day. It's like the cherry on top of, of a hard day's work in the summertime. <laughs> Coastal Creamery has a variety of selections. <laughs> oh my God. Coastal Creamery has a variety of selections for me to choose from. One of which happens to be my favorite is Cheesecake Fantasy. But sometimes the blueberries that they put in it are a little too frozen. And I don't... I... I don't like the blueberries too frozen. But you know, with Chicken Fantasy, it's like a triple whammy. Because... You got... First on top of the face, you got the... The, uh, what's it called? The cheesecake ice cream? Yeah, the... Mmm. Mmm. But it's a triple whammy because you got the blueberries, the strawberries, and the graham cracker. And it tastes like cheesecake. Tastes like fruity cheesecake. Huh? It's just a double whammy. Triple whammy. But I mean, sometimes cold stone cream would be a little too expensive for my taste. And a little too fattening. So what do you do to earn money for cold stones? Well, to earn the money for the cold stone cream we, which is like a special treat for me, <laughs> I'd, um... I mean, this is, it's only a part-time job. I mean, when I'm older, I'd like to, you know, maybe go to school, to college somewhere, you know, maybe. Mmm, kind of ambitious, but. What do you do? It's a kind of embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> what well, that? what I do, I mean, it makes me happy, but for a person of my age and stature, it's very embarrassing. How old and you are know you? the songs get anyways, I do I have a cream truck. But I mean How old are you? That's no comment. No comment. Ow Twenty eight. Um, <laughs> you know Um you know the ice cream truck has its pros and its cons. The cons being, you know, the ice cream song, you know, gets stuck in my head, and I just can't stop singing it, humming it, my singing voice is a little, mm, 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 mm. We won't talk about that singing voice of mine. <laughs> so we sometimes I get an underbite when I speak for a long period of time, you know, like, mmm, underbite, no, don't call me underbite, uncle. Mm. <laughs> Anyways. Um, I kinda get tired so I gotta go this soon, but I'll leave you with this this comment, okay? I like to drive the ice cream truck. Because at the end of the day, opposed to the cold stone queen of which are the selectables, <laughs> I can sneak a tweet <laughs> from the back of the truck without anybody knowing. <laughs>